have a president um, who's been in office. We can go to Bush. He got it um, done. Go to Reagan. He got it done. Now Obama's in office, and you want to act like children. All right, let's go on to Santa uh, Clarita, California. Steve on our independent line. Good morning. Yes, hi, good morning. Hi there. Um, the biggest thing I'm concerned about is this new super committee. Mm -hmm. Some people are calling it the super Congress because, to me, it violates basic principles of democracy by putting so much power in this special gang of, uh, of congressmen. Uh, there's a person who made a quote on the Huffington Post I'd like to briefly read. He says, what is the Super Congress? Let's see if history has an example of a similar body. Here's one, the Politburo of the USSR. The Politburo was made up of the top members of the Central Committee. It was responsible to and its members subject to the approval of the Central Committee. In reality, the Politburo was a self-perpetuating body that served as the executive branch of the Soviet Union and its decisions were de facto at the force of law. You wind up with this small group, 12, and what is the purpose of the rest of them. I believe that we need to look at this long-term procedural change that has been pushed through, and I hope you'll do a special show on it. It's reminding me of Naomi Klein's book, uh, Shock uh, Capitalism. Let, let's take a listen to exactly what Steve's talking about. Here's the president weighing in on this, uh, this committee, this group, that's going to look for other ways to make cuts or reduce spending or raise revenue. It establishes a bipartisan committee of Congress to report back by November with a proposal to further reduce the deficit, which will then be put before the entire Congress for an up or down vote. In this stage, everything will be on the table to hold us all accountable for making these reforms. Tough cuts that both parties would find objectionable would automatically go into effect if we don't act. President Obama speaking last night from the White House briefing room about this uh, deal that's been brokered. Uh, at the same time that was going on, House Speaker John Boehner was addressing uh, 